Are you confused by the process of seeking a modification of your home mortgage? Today we're going to discuss the do's and don'ts of requesting a home affordable modification. I'm Jim Keveny of Keveny Legal Group. We're a law firm servicing Pennsylvania and New Jersey. Every day we help people stay in their homes by guiding them through the process of a home affordable modification. We always like to tell our clients that when you're seeking a modification of a home mortgage under the HAMP program, there are a few things to do and other things to avoid. Would you like to learn what these things are? Join me as I share this helpful information. First, don't increase your consumer debt, particularly during the application process or after you're approved for a trial plan. Adding new credit cards, a car loan, or other debt to your credit profile could disqualify you from the program and from a practical standpoint is likely to leave you in the same financial crunch you're already experiencing. In addition, always file your taxes and maintain a bank account. In order to qualify for the HAMP program, you must be able to provide at least two years of previous tax returns and need to provide bank statements to prove income. These are also good suggestions to avoid liability for unpaid taxes and to qualify you for many other types of programs. Your entire income must be documented and shown on your bank statements. If less than 100% of your income is documented and shown on those bank statements, you may not be able to qualify for a HAMP modification. If you receive tips, rent, alimony, or other types of payments in cash, you should deposit them in your bank account before spending them and claim them on your taxes. You must continue to update your financial statements on a timely basis until a decision has been made on your modification. If you change jobs, receive a settlement, suffer a loss, or experience any other change in financial circumstances, you'll need to disclose that to the lender as part of your HAMP modification, or you might be denied for failing to be forthcoming about these circumstances. Your expense worksheet, which you fill out, is a proposed budget showing that you can afford a modified payment. Take that very seriously. It will help you determine whether a modification is going to be viable and it will also help the lender decide whether they want to give you one. Be honest. Include all of your income and expenses and do not exaggerate. Obviously, these are just a few suggestions for the HAMP modification process. To get the best results, you should contact a qualified and experienced attorney for advice and assistance. At Kevney Legal Group, we help people every day to stay in their homes and avoid foreclosure. We would welcome the opportunity to speak with you and guide you through the process of seeking a loan modification. You can reach us by calling 1-800-219-0939 or at jim at I'm Jim Kevney and you have a wonderful day.